Hi, for all of you who know me, this is Teresa, owner of Light Star Paranormal Investigation Team. And I would just like you to know that the following film does have real spiritual footage and real spiritual pictures. So I'm just advising viewer discretion. He's a Labradoodle. Labradoodle? Yeah. He's so cute. Thank you. Well, He's usually pretty friendly with people. Well, I, I know, but I yeah. just know when you're trying to take pictures, I have a, an American accent. Like, Holy Chromebook. <laughs> Does he take you for the walk? Does he take you for a walk? No, but he don't let me go out and leave here because he likes to get hot. Oh, I hear you. I hear you. <laughs> Boy, there you go, puppy. Oh, there you go, puppy. Yes, you are. You better get back or he'll put you. Come on. Come on. So, what's going on? I'm playing my panda pup. There's nothing to do right now. I know. It's pretty boring. Very boring. As soon as this is over, oh my gosh, you're going to be surprised. I will jog up the street. What? <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll just, I'll take Fred and uh, me and I will be zooming up the street. Yep. Well, actually, we won't have to worry because then most people take us for a ride. Yeah, that's true. And for all of those who are wondering who this person is talking in the background here, this is our executive director, Nick. Ready? Say hi, Nick. Hi, Nick. <laughs> He's also a comedian. He is very funny. Mm -hmm. So, are we going to go out to the field later on? It doesn't seem too bad out there. I think we should. I think we should, too. Yes. I want to find out who that little girl was. Yes, I would like to. I... And I'd like to know who that boy is, too. Mm -hmm. I think they're brother and sister. I think they might be too, because they look pretty close to each other. Yes. Hey, Linda, how's it going? It's going. How's it going with you? Oh, pretty good. How do you think we're doing on our project so far? Oh, very well. Our fans are going to love it. Yeah, I think so too. Oh, boy. It gets boring, though, when there's nothing to do. No, it is. It's very boring. Yeah. What was that? What the hell was that? Who's that? Hold on a second, please. You heard that, right? Yes, I heard that. Mm -hmm. I guess it's our friend Mr. Poltergeist in the kitchen again. Yes. Mm -hmm. What kind of tricks he's going to pull this time? I don't know. <laughs> oh. Maybe right. he'll steal the dinner plates. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you think he's hungry? Oh, probably. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I stay here, he says. 
I'm not really. I'm gonna go check out that noise. Where do you think it? You think it came from the kitchen? It sounded like it came from the kitchen, didn't it? Yeah. It was kitchen. Okay, let's check this out. of the attention span of a peanut. That is not very neighborly to say. But yeah, I do have a span of a peanut. As you can see, they captured a figure right near that tree. And if you look over here, there's somebody else behind that tree. That is awesome evidence. I can't wait to show Linda. I'll look at it later. I just woke up. All right. Get up and have some coffee and have some breakfast. I really, really want you to see this picture. It's really cool. You're really going to like it. I think we should go over there and go and do an audio either later on today or, or tonight. Find out who this girl is. Maybe you can find out who the boy is. Yes, that would be very interesting. Wow, that has to be one of the greatest things I've ever seen. And mind you, we do have a lot of awesome footage that we did capture that night. Uh, well, we'll analyze it later, though, because right now I have to hurry up and I have to get to the stage and start my show. Oh, hi, Teresa. Hi, Teresa. How are you today? What are you doing? What are you guys doing? Oh, we're getting ready to go and do a show. Are you going to come with us? I definitely am. Oh, great. Let's go.
Tracer, hi Tracer, what are you doing this morning, Tracer? What are we going to be talking about today? Well, I thought today we'd talk about buses. Oh, buses, I like buses. Do you know what buses do, Priscilla? Buses, I mean, they take people places. And then the people get on the bus and the people call passengers. And the bus driver and he, he goes up the street and he drops people off like at the mall and he goes to the park. And those are my favorite places to go. I like going to those places. You do, Priscilla? Oh, that's awesome. Well, can we go for a bus ride today, Teresa? Oh, uh, we'll see, Priscilla. We'll see what happens. Oh, that'd be great if we could go for a bus ride today. That'd be awesome. You know, yesterday I was pretending I was a bus driver. This is playing with Cluster. And Cluster and me, and we were, was my passenger, and I was a bus driver. And we were going all around the backyard. Yeah, I saw you yesterday, Priscilla. You look like you were having a lot of fun. I was having that fun I pretend that bus driver would go, Wee! Woo woo! Beep beep! Join us for our next episode. Have a good day. Bye. Patiently, you know, you're waiting. Who's the handsome boy then? Hmm? Yeah, just waiting. Say, hurry up, dinner. Yeah, yeah, you say, hurry up, dinner. Lofi, are they coming yet? No. Where's dinner? Where is it? You have to look this way, boo. It comes in from that direction. Probably gonna be a couple minutes. Yep. Dinner, 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 dinner. Yep. Dinner, dinner, dinner. Need an extra pair of hands? Huh? Need an extra oh. pair of hands? Okay. <laughs> Hi, we're in the garden. Is there anybody here who want to talk? You want to talk? Tell me what my name is. I'm filming here the other day. And we caught the sound of a gun cocking. Was that you? Was that you? Oh, it was you. And who's me? 
What's your name? Okay, don't be Talk to me. Come to the fence. Hello? Well, that was clear. Hey, who are you? The voice that just said hello. Who are you? Jeff, hi. Yeah? Are you one of the guards here? Do you guard this place? Yeah? How did you die, Jeff? Say some of your poetry. <laughs> smell that? Is that you? I can smell that. Smells like an aftershave or cologne. Is that you? How close to the fence are you? Right here. That, yeah. yeah, can you talk into my phone? This is my phone. Can you talk into my phone? Can you say hello again? Say hello. Thank you. Thank you so much, Jeff. I will talk to you soon. Okay, honey, you have a good night. Okay, honey, you will. Well, after I'm finished doing this, and then I've got to put another Haskell's Rainbow show together. This is going to be fun. It's been a while since you put one together. Only did one last week. It hasn't been that long. <laughs> Oh, did you hear that? Did you hear that was not on the video? Uh oh. What you growling at, baby? Something he doesn't like. Uh oh, is there something out there, baby? Something out there he's not liking. Yeah. He doesn't, he doesn't do that unless there's somebody out there he doesn't like. Or something. There's somebody out there. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's looking right bent that way. Uh oh. I told you he started his hobby up. Yeah. <laughs> what are you barking at, baby? Is there somebody over there? What are you barking at, honey? He must could smell something. I got you a nursery rhyme. Oh, okay. What is it? It's called Lofi's Harley. Okay, let's hear it. It's got Lofi's got a Harley. He's got a Harley. And it goes ruff, 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 ruff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so funny, Eric. <laughs> You're funny. This here is the gorge. On the other side, what you see, that is the USA. On the side I'm on right now is Canada. This is where the great battle took place. But as you can see, over time, the water has risen, and now it is a great river. It is what they call the Niagara River. What did you think of the show, Lofi? Did you like it? Did you like the show? That was pretty cool, eh? What do you think, buddy? 
So did she call back about us doing that investigation at the house? Uh, no, not yet, but hopefully she'll get a hold of us soon. Okay, so there's no angle. Looking forward, that's why I kind of rushed through the show today. But that's all right. That's okay. Oh, well, hopefully she'll get a hold of us soon. Very soon. Yes. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm here by myself right now. Uh, just looking over some uh, footage that we did the other day. This stuff is amazing. Absolutely amazing. As you can see, we captured a figure right near that tree. And if you look over here, there's somebody else behind that tree. That is awesome evidence. I can't wait to show Linda. Yeah. 
Then what the hell are you talking to Furry Desk for? I just told him where to go and how to get there. You're full of shit, too. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. No, I'm not. Mm -hmm. Fine, if you don't like it, leave. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I see you. I see you next week. Bye. Bye. Have a nice life. Have a little beast up, baby. Bye. Oh, Linda, what's wrong? Eric left. What do you mean, Eric left? He left. He had one of his fits again, and he left. He's been gone four hours now. Oh, what's he upset about now? He's always having his little childish temper tantrums. I don't know. Something you said to him. Oh, brother. How long's he been gone for? He's been gone four hours. Four hours. I just get back from doing a show, and he's been gone for four hours. Yes. Did he see where he was going? No. Oh, boy. Well, I wouldn't panic too much. You know, he always comes back. But if he's not back within the next couple hours, I think maybe we should call the police. I think so. So what the cops say when you were talking to them outside? They said they're going to be looking for him. They're going to be looking for Eric? Oh, good. But this isn't like Eric. He's never gone this long. He's usually gone for maybe three or four hours, and then he comes home. Yeah. But you said he was gone for four hours just as I got back from my show. I don't know what's going on with him. But I'm pretty upset about it. How about you? Yeah, this isn't like him at all, and this isn't fair to us for him to make us worry like this. It's not It's not fair at all whatsoever. And he better not do it again. Are you going to kill him when he gets back? <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm going to kill him, all right. <laughs> I'm going to choke him. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. Well, I hope he hurries back soon. Hell, I'm bored out of my mind. Oh, honey, what happened? <laughs> no. I hope you get to call the cops, man. They're gonna call the cops on us now, these crackheads. Oh my god, what the hell happened to you? Where the hell have you been? You've been gone for hours, man. Where have you been? What is wrong with you? What the hell is that? I don't know. Is there a hole in me? What happened to you? Where were you? The last time I know, I was in the woods. Oh my. Holy crap. What do you think, Linda? I don't know. I just know I got blood all over my hands. Oh my gosh, you, 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 we better take him to the hospital. Holy cow, he's bleeding out all over the place. Yeah, yeah I'm yeah. passing out. I'm passing out. <laughs> I'm passing out.
Oh my gosh, did you see that picture? Like, look at this picture. It this, is amazing. This picture here, look at this. We have a Ku Klux Klan, we have a soldier, we have a teenager, and we have a demon girl. I want to look up more on this. This is this is crazy. I've never seen anything so combined in my life ever. This has got to be one in a million pictures. This is crazy. Yeah, this is this is crazy. It's just, I mean, I can't wait to to go check it out again, and 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 hopefully they'll talk to us, and we can find out what is exactly going on with them. I don't know if I really want to talk to them or not, especially with that little girl. That little girl is definitely a demon girl because I expanded her, and it, it's definitely a demon face. Well, what we'll do is take salt with us. Well, you know what they say, too, right? That demons will never show their true identity, not unless you expand a picture. Yes. And I did expand that picture, and it is definitely a demon face. And what we'll do is we'll do the same thing we did before. We'll cover ourselves with salt. Yeah. Well... You know, I did read up and I did hear something about a demon in this area called spin seed. It's supposed to mean the point of evil. Oh, wow. Mm hmm. So I don't know if I really want to go and do this audio now, like I've been bugging to do now that I've taken a closer look at this picture. I don't know if it's a good idea or not. Like, look at the girl. The girl is totally different than the rest of them. Yes, definitely. But we have to go check it out and see why they're here. Absolutely. So it's over here. It's nighttime, you can't really see anything. This is the area where I caught the picture of the demon, the KKK, the soldier. And the young teenager. If there's anybody there who wants to talk, please speak up. Wow, that was pretty creepy. What do you think? Yeah, that was pretty creepy. You could feel the energy in the trees. Yeah, it was pretty, pretty freaky. Yes. So, you know, maybe we'll find something, maybe we won't. You never know, right? Yeah, I hope so. I hope so, too. Yes.
So what do you think of that investigation, Linda? It was very interesting. Do you know that I think I just caught an arm going past you on the wall? Oh, wow. There it goes again. What the heck? Wow. I love this place. It is so haunted. How are you feeling, Eric? I'm oh, pretty good. You feeling better? Mm-hmm. That's good. How about you, Lofi? You doing all right? Yeah, we're all going to settle down and go to sleep soon, eh? Wow, I'm catching some pretty interesting stuff here. I know some of it's dust particles, but some of it is not. Wow, interesting. Yeah, the thing I just saw on the wall over there near you, Linda, was definitely something out of the ordinary. Oh, wow. Well, we hope you all enjoyed the show. We really enjoyed it. We enjoyed being here at Niagara Falls and doing the Happiness Inn investigation. Uh, we did find a lot of spirits. We did find a lot of fun. We did have a lot of fun. Um, so, until the next time, and we hope you don't miss our next episode. We'll see you then.